It's been a couple of years since you saved Robin from the grabber. Since you saved yourself from your dad. You and Robin have been growing closer and that friends with benefits has slowly turned into you guys dating. You haven't told anybody yet and you didn't really plan to doing it soon, but you kind of guessed that Finny had started to catch on. Oh, hey, listen, hey, hey, yeah, um, sorry, I, I was looking for you. God. Okay, um, I wanted to know if you wanted to, um, well, it was more of me and Robin, um, we wanted to know if you wanted to come over to his house for a sleepover. Yeah, I know that's like for kids, but I mean like just to hang out and spend the night. Does that sound more adult-like to you? Well, okay, just because he didn't tell you, like, what if, wait, we were just talking about it, and I got tea first. Yeah, fine, you can go talk to Robin to confirm, whatever. Okay. Shit, I gotta find him first. You didn't know where that came from. So you just went to find a Robin. Shit, 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 shit. Oh my god, I'm so fucking lucky. Robin, Robin, hey! Oh, hi, Finny. Did you need something? Yeah, um, oh my god, I'm so happy I found you. Um, are you okay? Yeah, um, I was wondering, uh, if we could have a, uh, like, overnight at your place? Where's this coming from? It was just an idea. Uh, uh, okay, did you need to, like, work on something? Oh, uh, it would be me and listener. Oh. Um. Yeah, sure. Did, is this, like, for anything, or? No, not really. We could invite some more people if you wanted to. Oh, no, I don't care. I mean, my uncle's out tonight. So if you wanted to invite more people, I'm up for that. All right, sweet. Uh, I'll go tell us another then. You were looking everywhere, and finally you found Robin. So you went up to him to confirm. Listener, hey. Um, did Finn? Oh, yeah. Do you recommend making sure for him? The fuck? Sorry, I can't talk when you're around. Listener, I didn't mean it like that. Oh my god. Do you have to think that about everything I say? Okay. Well, you're coming to the little sleepover thing, right? Yeah, okay. No, I don't know if... I mean, I told Finny he could invite other people. Unless you wanted it to just be us. <laughs> yeah. I'm sure you wouldn't mind. Okay, well... I mean, you can come over now. So that you're already there. Yeah? Okay, let's just... Go now then. 
Robin leads you to his house, which you didn't really need him to since you already know the path by heart, but it was still nice, obviously, to walk with him like it always was. And even though it was years since the incident happened, you guys always made sure to go a separate way, not the way you used to go. You always made sure to strive away from your dad's house. Well, your dad's old house. Alright, come on. In. I'm so happy you were. Okay, I'm not gonna be ready for all this social interaction, but I wanna make Finny happy since we haven't hung out very much. So, before he gets here, I'm gonna need as much attention from you as I can possibly get. Well, I don't think you wanna tell them yet, do you? Yeah. So come sit down. I am not going to be ready for the buffer. <laughs> you and Robin hang out on the couch together until you hear a knock at the door. Robin goes and answers it. was okay. Uh, it's just Donna and Gwen and Maddie. Maddie. You didn't remember that name very well. All you could remember is, do you think that used to be one of Finney's bullies, but they made up. Move aside, jackass. <gasps> Listen, her hate. Oh my god, okay. This is actually so exciting. I haven't been to, like, one of these in so long, because Finny never takes me anywhere anymore. Ever since you guys, like, you know, became more mature or whatever. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy to see you. Everyone came in, and you guys ended up making just a pizza for dinner and hanging out. And then you all went up to Robin's room and started playing some games. Oh, guys, uh, do you guys want to do, like, uh, seven minutes and seven, but, like, without the weird part? You feel... Gwen, shut up. <laughs> Ooh. Trust me, I'm trying to do something here. Ooh, don't go no, it's not for Donna, it's for someone else. Mm, you like your friend? No, not me. Fine. Okay, does everyone else go with that? Everyone says yes. And you looked at Finny kind of weird. He didn't know what he was doing, but you could tell he was doing something. Alright, let me go grab the something from downstairs. What would you need from... Oh, okay. Finny runs downstairs and comes back up with a bottle in his hand. Like a glass bottle. Uh, Finny, what do you need that for? Well, I thought, like, the old way was boring, where you have to put items in a hat, or whatever, I thought that was stupid. So, why don't we just, like, mix it with spin the bottle? Uh, didn't you think that would be cool to ask before you just... No? Um, is everyone cool with that? Yeah, I'm cool with that. I mean, I guess. It's kind of... I mean, yeah, I'm good with it. Same here. Mm, I 
क्या शंख होता है फाइन वॉट एवर whatever funny who is going to start or whatever um funny since it was your idea you should start what no i, I don't want to yeah you're starting fine funny sits down and sets the bottle in the middle of you guys and spins it It slows and comes to a stop. Uh. Oh. Uh. Oh. All right, Finny, let's go. Okay. Uh, Quinn, shut up. Him and Donna go into the closet. And you set a seven-minute timer on your little... a uh, clock thing they listen what do you think they're doing in there probably something like stupid right yeah they're really like making out your timer goes off and you just yell at them that the time is up Finny opens the door, and both their faces are flushed, so he can already guess. They come back and sit down, and Finny makes Gwen skip doing spinning the bottle. He doesn't want her to. So, it's Maddie's turn. After a couple rounds of doing that, it gets back to you. You've already gone before, but... It landed on Gwen. Finny was relieved to see at least it was you who landed on her. You guys didn't do anything in there, obviously. You just talked. But now it was your turn again. Please don't fucking land on someone else. Please don't fucking land on someone else. Please don't fucking land on someone else. Oh. Alright, um. Let's go then, listener. Yes, yes, yes. Oh my fucking god, yes, yes, yes. Vinny, what's up with you? Why are you doing that? Oh my god, this is what I wanted. Wait, are they the two people you... Yeah. Oh my god, it's literally so obvious that there's something going on between them. Okay, I mean, yeah, I have noticed something. Alright. God, this is a tight fucking closet. Oh, sorry, I don't, on average, go into my closet. Yeah, I mean. I only, like. I. I, I use this to hang out clothes, not to fucking hide in. We didn't really do anything. It was just boring. I mean, I don't really know him. But apparently him and Finny are friends now or something, so... I don't know. I just can't wait for this to be over. I mean, yeah, I know it's... Uh, sleepover or whatever Finny wanted an overnight I wish it wasn't why didn't I say anything well like I said before we don't really like get to 
do this as much anymore. And I think he's happy, so I'm not gonna, like, ruin his mood just because I want more time with you. Yeah, so what if that's why I want him to leave? I mean, that's a pretty valid reason if you ask me. What? I mean, if they left, then I wouldn't have to go into a stupid closet just to... This is a, like a hot closet, of course my face is going to be red. Besides, uh, how can you even see it? It's fucking pitch black in here. I'm fine. I'm fine. No, I, I promise I'm fine. Fine. Oh my fuck. No, oh fuck. <laughs> Sorry. Stop moving around. Oh fuck. <laughs> no, that means stop. That doesn't mean move around. You guys come out and you catch Finny smirking at you, but when you give him a confused glance, he looks away. Welcome back. That felt like an eternity, and that's probably because Finny isn't funny. What? I'm funny, I think. Right? <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, you're funny, Vinny. Donna, you're only saying that because you two like each other, and you two just aren't saying anything because it's really obvious that you don't. Gwen, you need to learn how to shut your mouth. Uh, Robin, are you, like, cold or something? Huh? Oh, no, um, I mean, yeah, uh, I mean, if you're cold, I don't understand why you would get a pillow instead of a blanket. Maybe you should have any sort of blankets? Why not? Yeah, uh, I, I just... Yeah. Okay. Do you guys want to keep playing this, or do you want to play a different game? How about we play the game called Going to Bed? Because I'm tired. What? It's only... Okay. Yeah, it's late. But still, like, we don't have to go to bed. Yeah, we do. Can we just go to bed, please? Ugh. Fine. Um, okay. One problem. Um. Where are we gonna sleep? Um. I mean. Probably downstairs. Because that's where the couch is. Robin, you and me both know that that couch can only fit, like, max two people to sleep on. Yeah, I know. So, maybe you and Gwen can take the couch or something, and um, Donna and Maddie could take the floor. Um, no way, if we were going to be separating, me and Donna would sleep on the couch, and Vinny and Maddie would sleep on the floor, because I'm not letting Maddie have that privilege, and I'm not putting Donna through that suffering, sleeping with a boy, ew. Also, wait, where would listener go? Um, this nerd would just stay up here. Oh. Don't think of it as anything weird, okay? It's just there's not enough room downstairs, so. So are you gonna sleep in the- No, I would sleep on the floor. Obviously. Yeah, sure, Robin. You are going to sleep on the floor. Separate. Totally, 100% believe you. Alright guys, let's go downstairs so we don't bother them anymore. Finny, what are you? Okay. Good night, you two. Yeah, good night to you too, Finny. No, I don't know what his deal is. You do? Alright. Do you think he's... <laughs> uh, well, no, there's no... What do you mean? I wasn't... That obvious. Was I? Oh, well, uh, no, there's no way I was, <laughs> what, oh, uh, I'm just cold, yeah, uh, no, you can lay down, I will stay on the floor, no, I'm, Fine. You can lay down. Listener. Go lay down. I'm fine. No, don't. Okay. Nope, there's nothing. I just don't worry about my hands. 
Can you give me my pillow back? I already told you I'm just cold. This nerd can I have my pillow back, please? No, uh, stop, stop, stop. There's nothing, just give me my pillow. Thank you. Um, just, uh, I'm just gonna sleep down here. Just in case, you know. No, I'm really set on staying down here. Listener, don't worry about it. Okay, just, you can lay down in the bed. Uh, and... I know, but I just want to sit down here. Um. No, I'm fine. It's not. No, no, don't. I, it's not like I don't want to. I just. I mean, I. Um. No, I'm fine. I'm fine, I'm fine. Stop getting closer. I'm fine, listen, I'm fine. No, I, I don't sit. <laughs> no, um, can you just get off? Just get off of the pillow. <laughs> Don't move around. Listeners, stop it. It's not my fault you're, um, you did that. It's not my fault you, uh, no, wait, what are you? Stand up. Get, get up. Get off. I'm 
know they're sleeping, but I, I don't want to wake them up. <laughs> Finny's already suspicious. If, if, if he hears anything, he'll...
Stop. 